with Mo Carter. Last summer, Swag Media Day did not start off well for Alabama A&M head coach Connell Maynard. He and the student athletes actually showed up late to the session, and that caused them to miss several activities. Coach Maynard was not happy about the scenario, and he actually used that as motivation to become a better leader and a better coach. And by the end of 2018, Alabama A&M had their first winning season in several years. Fast forward to 2019, and things are smoother for Coach Connell Maynard and the Bulldogs. Now they know they need to up the ante and eventually compete for the SWAC East title. We don't want to stay flat. We don't want to go backwards. So we don't want to have another winning season. We have opportunity to compete for a championship. But in order to do that, Alabama A&M must beat a team that's had their number since 2014, Alcorn State. The Braves have won five straight East Division crowns and are the favorites to win it in 2019. Right behind them are the Bulldogs. We need to beat the teams that we beat last year. And then, of course, we got to beat uh, – uh, Alcorn, uh, Southern, and Grambling. And we play all three of those guys on the road this year. So we got a very tough schedule, uh, but we're up for the challenge. And it's so competitive now. So each school is getting better every year. So we have to do the things we have to do at Alcorn State to make sure that, that we're getting the winning edge as well. So in order for Alabama A&M to compete for that ground, Maynard will rely on players like Akil Glass and Armani Holloway. Both guys were picked as all-conference selections in 2018 and made the preseason squads for 2019. Both of these guys also understand why raising their game to championship status is important. Uh, everybody's been getting better, you know. Everybody's been pushing themselves. Everybody's been holding each other accountable. So uh, we've all been getting better together as a team. We've all been meshing and. Uh, that's the biggest thing, just holding each other accountable every day. I really think we're going to uh, rise from what we was last year. I think we're going to be way uh, better than we was last year because who we have coming in, the freshmen, they're really good. Six returning starters that will be helpful for the freshmen to look up to, to be the leaders for them. At the beginning of media day, new SWAT commissioner Dr. Charles McClellan made some exciting announcements about the future of the conference. Tiffany's and company will now provide the championship trophy. He also announced that the SWAC football championship games will be played on campus well beyond the 2019 football season. Several of the coaches in the SWAC are happy about the new championship plan. I think it's a win-win situation for the programs that, that are really good programs and have and, and are going to win those, those conference championships. So. So that'll wrap up things here in Birmingham for the 2019 SWAC Media Day. 